over a hundred names in many different cultures of the world. He is said to be the tallest and largest angel in heaven in his true form, the width of his body being equal to the size of the world. When invoked, he appears as a pillar of fire, his face more dazzling than the sun. He is the demiurge of classical Jewish mysticism, the male form of the Shekinah, the Shekinah being the female manifestation of the Most High. In the Kabbalah, he is the angel who led the children of Israel through the wilderness after the Exodus and is the twin brother or half-brother of the angel, Sandalphone. In the traditions of the Jews, Metatron is the supreme angel of death, and under his wing are the subordinate princes of death, Gabriel, Samael, and Azrael. It is he whom God daily gives orders as to the souls that are to be taken that day, and these orders he transmits to his subordinates. In the unlimited supply of untapped resources. The first trillionaires will be those who mine asteroids. where you can do whatever you want. You can have really relaxed, slow-paced stuff where you can take it. You can have... really relaxed slow paced stuff where you can take it easy or you can be on the edge of your seat shaking making split second decisions this is Eve I would describe myself as a kind of a freedom fighter my very first character was a Mimitar character because they just seemed like the coolest, you know, most brutal people. And I was like, I want to be that guy. I started out doing the, the missions in high sec and I want to be on the side of the people who are fighting against the oppression, against the bad guys. And once I learned that you can basically help them and fight the other factions, that was, you know, that's all I wanted to do. very satisfying feeling, you know, starting out at the bottom and working my way up, getting to more advanced, you know, situations, bigger ships, bigger enemies, and all that kind of cool stuff. that I wanted to sit in more than anything was a paladin, which is the Amara.